In a changing music industry, artists are coming up with new ways to earn a paycheck, from epic tours to selling the rights to their music. While streaming has exploded in popularity, it actually pays less to artists than album sales used to. So how lucrative is this new trend? We take a look by the numbers. The global music industry had a record-setting 2023 with audio song streams totaling $4 trillion, according to a report by music firm Luminate. That's a 22.3% increase from the previous year's count at 3.4 trillion streams. But with streaming paying less, some superstars have turned to selling the rights to their music catalogs to catalog right companies who then get the royalties. The sale of music catalogs last year was about one half what it was at the market high point in 2021. Justin Bieber sold his catalog for north of $200 million in 2023. According to Billboard, the deal covered all 290 titles in Bieber's catalog through the end of 2021. Last year, Katy Perry sold her master recording royalties and her music rights from her first five albums for a reported $225 million, according to Billboard. The boss, Bruce Springsteen, got in on the action as well, selling his entire recorded music and publishing catalog for $500 million to Sony Music, according According to Variety. When an artist sells their catalog, they're guaranteed a paycheck instead of being subject to when and if their music is in style. Selling copyrights can also breathe new life into old hits. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.